Welcome back, everybody. I'm your host, Kelly Sparks. Hey, hey. Good beard. Back again with my part time co host, Mr. Curtis Harmon. Hello. Curtis, uh, won a, uh, he got called in the lottery, one of the local uh, whiskey lotteries that we have at mm -hmm. our liquor store. Uh, and this is the bourbon that he decided to purchase. Which yes. is, can you tell us a bit about it, Curtis? It is Garrison Brothers Cowboy bourbon cowboy bourbon. i don't know what any of that fucking shit means nothing i don't know what any of it means. Well, i know it came in a nice lovely casket well yeah right <laughs> <laughs> like uh like the guys that i have the uh the bourbon east texas bourbon society like they say all the time bourbon 51 percent corn and 49 percent bullshit exactly so um garrison brothers prides themselves on their whiskey get a sticker <clears throat> they are incredibly proud of it uh and that is shown by the price so, 6,440 bottles produced of this here release, yeah. and this is bottle number... That is a straight up casket, isn't it? Yep. It looks like a casket. This is bottle 1,413. It's got a metal. It's so got it a metal. It's a, it's a gold metal winner. Uh, looks like a, a star for a sheriff. Right. But... It's got a nice little... What I think of like when you have a uh, the band around like your cowboy hat, what's that called? Mm -hmm. uh, I don't know what it's called. I don't know. Do you want to pour them up? You want me to pour them I don't up? Pour them. Bonnie's like, I want some. Bonnie. She's like, I got in the middle of the table this time. Right. Calm, of that. calm down. That's enough of that. Uh, 66.95% alcohol by volume, 133.9 mm. proof. Get out. That is a tight cork. That cork is in there. It's a tight cork. I have tried. A very small amount of this previously. You pour your own. I'm on the last and it so is, good. it is all there. Yeah. You know, we talked about it on the the proper number twelve video, and I said that you, you said that you like high proof yeah. bourbons, and I was like, boy, are you in for it on this one? Because this one just it, it brings it. But I'm gonna let you be the judge of that. Good grief, Bonnie. Let everybody get in there. Hey, Bonnie. Yeah. Bonnie's like, I get in the middle of the table now. Oh, that's heavy. That's super sweet and mm -hmm. caramely. I don't know if caramely is the right word for it. It's a word now. Caramely. Brown sugar. Oh, it's all the classic bourbon. Yeah. But it's just a, it's just all right there. It's like a concentrate. Let's see. Let's <laughs> see how this concentrated bourbon tastes. For me, it's that the all with that first sip. Even the, the, the last time I tried it, it's very much grain forward, and then that grain's there for a second, and then it just melts into all kinds of things going on. Yeah, it's super syrupy, creamy. Like when you first told me about it, and it and it's probably kind of mellowed out a little bit when you first told me about it. Oh God! Oh God! Don't do that. <laughs> oh, she burnt. Oh, you son, of a, son of a bitch. Bitch of a bitch. <laughs> uh, when you first told me about it, y'all might hear Bonnie puking in the background. Because she eats just random things. And if you've been watching the show for a while, you know that she does this often. She's weird. Um, so it's like, when you first told me about it, you're like, it is hot. I don't feel like it's as hot. Does it feel as hot now? No, it doesn't. Okay, so it has mellowed out a little bit. Yeah, a little bit. It's yeah. been open. And like I said, I poured maybe... Uh, a half ounce out and try to put the cork right back in and it's set for another two weeks uh, so it's mellowed some but the the first time i poured it up i just like did my normal nosing and stuck my nose all the way in there and that was a mistake well i like what they got out here on the side so dan garrison and uh the guys or the garrison brothers dan garrison i believe is one of the owners they're super proud of this whiskey incredibly proud and at the bottom they got a little texas here mm -hmm. Uh, but underneath it, it says drink like an adult. Well, you pretty much have to be. Yeah, they don't adult. give you a lot of options on this one. It, and nothing against women, but I think you need to be a grown ass man to drink this one. Yeah, you got a little hair on your chest one right. way or another. If you're a woman and you drink this and it doesn't bother you, <laughs> I, I'm going to need to see like a pap smear receipt or. <laughs> receipt. I'm going to need to see a scan of your uterus. Right. right. I think that might be the highest proof bottle I've ever drank. I can't recall anything that was 133.9. I know. Had some 126s, 127s, and stuff like that. I think the highest I've had, well, the highest whiskey I've ever had, not bourbon, but whiskey, 
was that uh, Cat's Eye Obtainium 14 year light whiskey. It was like 100, 140 something proof. Jesus. But the highest bourbon I believe I had is uh, Elijah Craig Barrel Proof. It was like 136. Ah. So it's not too far off. But this, I enjoy this. This is super freaking good. Yeah, it smells amazing. The yeah. longer you let it kind of sit there and let it air out a little bit, it just smells. It, does, it smells delicious. It smells like like almost like uh, candy perfume. Yes. Man, All right. let's get one more sip and we'll call it a day. Okay. That's incredibly creamy, spicy mouthfeel. That's if it wasn't so damn expensive, I'd have probably bought one. Yeah, it was. It was. It's up there. It comes with a tag. There is a price tag on it. Yeah. And I think most of it is for this little metal right here. Mm -hmm. I mean, the, the metal in the box is what you're paying for. But Right. Um, it is a cool ass box. I mean, it's, you know, when you set a price tag on that, one, number one, it's got to be good juice in the bottle. Right? It is. And they hit that mark. And mm -hmm. then you got to have something outside of that, right? Because you can get some really good juice in some cheaper bottles. Yeah, But for sure. To have that high proof and all the little bells and whistles that go with it, you got to to have the price tag that it had on it. It's got to come with more than just good juice in the bottle. Which I will agree with one thing that they got on here. Maybe okay, it's aged at least five years, so that's that's pretty good. That's good to know. The right here on the the last line it says the nectar is so deliciously sweet the flavor overpowers the bite. I would agree with that. Agreed. I, I would agree with that. It like, does have, like he said, when you said a spicy mouthfeel, yeah. it does feel like a bunch of little scorpions dancing mm -hmm. around in there, yeah. just, you know, getting after it. But it tastes good while it's happening. Oh, yeah. It's, <laughs> you enjoy the pain that it, right. it accompanies. So, man, that's really good. I think I uh, appreciate you for uh, sharing it with me. Yeah, it's a... Um, it's one that you know we're going to take our time with. Obviously, we'll we'll, oh, yeah. we'll look at it again on the the bearded idiots. But to me, this is a this is a true sipping whiskey. Oh yeah. You know what I mean? I don't yeah. want to. I don't even want to try it with water. No. I don't want to try it with ice. I don't want to try it with anything. I want it to be. That's like a campfire whiskey. Oh yeah. You know yeah. what I mean? You don't even need a campfire. Just drink that and just stay plenty warm. <laughs> <laughs> Agreed. But. I think that's all we got on this one. Uh, thanks for watching. Like the video and subscribe. Thanks again to Curtis for bringing this over and sharing it with me. <laughs> you okay? Yeah, was that a sneeze or a cough? It was a cough. Oh, okay. Well, I don't have to say bless you. You drying me out, but... Uh... <laughs> <laughs> uh, thanks for watching. Like and subscribe. Don't forget to check the description below for all the ways to help out with the bills around the house. Check out the Bearded Idiots. We have random tomfoolery every week or bi-weekly now or yeah it looks like we're going bi-weekly bi-weekly for the for the time being longer episodes though longer episodes bi-weekly so you can listen to half now and then half the next week yeah. right. you're an adult do it however you want to yeah and fuck your face so. <laughs> uh thanks for watching like always drink some whiskey share it with your friends and family be safe don't drink and drive take care and we'll see you next time cheers